Hey everybody, I thought I'd do a quick how-to video on removing the rubber eye cup from your insult spotter. Uh, I've wanted to remove it just so I could use a digiscoping adapter and with the eye cup in place, you've got a non-uniform thickness which makes it tough to center your camera and then of course by design, uh, this rotates so you can't keep your, your camera in the landscape position. Um, I searched all over the internet, couldn't find um, any posts anywhere on any of the forums or, or videos on YouTube with, with someone who had done it before. So I picked up the phone call Jason Bainey at Euro Optic and, and while he had not done it, he did at least understand uh, what was going on under here. Gave me a little tip for, just gave me a little confidence to, to give it a go. And after I, I did it, uh, I uh, can't believe I waited so long because it's pretty straightforward. But this ring here actually sits on top of the rubber and then underneath the rubber is a little split ring. So this ring here, you actually just um, push backwards towards the scope. So I just get a nail kind of under the ring and pull forward on the rubber and you'll see it start to, uh, to work its way off. So the ring splits there, and then this piece, uh, the split ring comes off pretty easy. You just kind of pull on the rubber, and you'll see the little split ring here. Comes off just like that. So with that off, I can use uh, this little adapter. Just got it recently. Really happy with it. I'll put a uh, link to the website in the video description, but use these little pads inside inside this piece. Uh, they come in different sizes, so you can, can get the fit that you want, but I don't have a phone in here to show you, but it will, uh, it will hold my iPhone 8, just the standard size in this landscape position, and I can I can carry this thing around, so pretty compact. Get an idea what it looks like here. All right, once you're done, you just pull this off. The, uh, the retaining ring, obviously, uh, will go on in, in this direction. I think it's easier to, I'll put this on just to see how it fits. It snaps into place just like this. Um, it's obviously much easier to, to put it back on if it's already inside the eye cap. So do that. There it is inside the eye cap. Snaps into place, and then you just pull the retaining ring forward. Kind of spin it around just like I did to when I took it off. And just make sure it's uh, all the way on top of the retaining ring and over the rubber. But you see once that it's on, it's secure. And it works just like it did before. Hope that's helpful.